I am a musician and an epic rock and, rock and roller, as you can tell by my really cool riffs on the guitar. I'm also a streamer, as you can see by my really, really cool light sound in the background there. But more than that, did you know, I am also da 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 a fully licensed historian, as indicated by my cardigan. That's right, you heard me. I have an honor spec in history from the University of Western Ontario, if you can believe that. And as such, when I downloaded Two Point Campus today, I thought, hey, this is the perfect opportunity to build the liberal arts college of my dreams. So without further ado, Professor Rudysworth is going to start building. <laughs> let's go. Let's get into it. Man, holy jeez. I've been excited for this game for a while. Oh, we get a cutscene right off the bat. Here we go. What's this now? We got, we got land scene. That's great. We got magic bubbles and drones. Always fun there. Classic paper airplane. What a nerd that guy was. Oh, that's pretty cool. He's doing the robot dance while he's a robot. Oh, the, the teacher's asleep. Oh, but now he's giving a speech. Wow. This this is this is comedy gold right here. I actually do legitimately love this. This is great. Oh, but then it's just oh you're laying blueprints. You're laying blueprints, baby. <laughs> that's 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 the real gem. Access denied. Select a room to change the permissions to decide which staff and students are allowed in it. Ooh. Already looking interesting. I'm Albert Crank, uh, your own personal advisor, and I'm here to help. You may not have any experience as a campus administrator, but the people at Freshley County, I read that as Fleshlight immediately, at Freshley County College are eager to give you a chance. I'm not sure what that says about them, but hey, let's head to Freshley Meadows and get started on your academic empire. I like the sound of that. Academic empire? Woo! I'm here to make the big ones, the big, big fucking bucks out here at this this liberal arts college. This countryside college has low expectations and a nice canal. It's the perfect place to start your career. I like canals. I really like canals. As as the esteemed Professor Hootiesworth, I am very cultured and do enjoy a nice sip of tea on the gondola as we travel along the Venetian canals. Or even better, the Dutch canals. Ooh, very, very fancy. If you're on the Dutch canals, ooh, oh, 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 you know, you know you mean business. Campus Management 101. This countryside college has lost... Okay, the same thing. Same thing as before. A university is not something that one simply opens, like a savings account or a jar of like a reference to that old Lord of the Rings meme. One does not simply walk into Mordor. long ago by dignified people who wore bowler hats and Such spoke by a subtitle the spoke by a subtitle like in the old black and white films and it is our job <laughs> to keep it all going and try not to touch anything try not to touch anything I, I, I beg to differ first day of school welcome to Fresh Lee Meadows where life moves slowly and expectations are lowly a little bit of wordplay there. An esteemed, esteemed liberal, liberal arts degree to brain like my, my own is uh, very familiar with uh, wordplay such as this. I can recognize it quite quickly, I will have you know. The Two Point Countryside is the perfect place to start your career, learn the ropes, make mistakes, and hit the ground smiling. Course info, Scientography. Sounds, 
Ooh. My mic's falling all over the place. I keep jostling it here. Gotta stop doing that. Yeah. All right. Scientography sounds vaguely, concerningly similar to uh, Scientology, but I'll leave it at that. Student didn't take 10. So I, I guess I need to take 10 students through Scientography. Sure. Frequently asked questions. Well, on campus, uh, before you start churning out geniuses, you'll need to learn the basics of campus management. Of course. Try moving the camera and having a look around. Oh, my mic is in the way of my keys is the only issue. There we go. Okay. Pan camera zoom. I can pan with the right mouse button too. Okay. Um, pitch. I like pitching. Rotate. And Q and E. R and F to pitch too. Okay. Camp is going to be running a Scientography course. Let's start by building a science lab. Okay. Build a science lab. So I need to go to construction and build a science lab. Okay, that's easy enough. It's just like two-point hospital. Easy. So it's telling me to build it beside it, like there. I kind of want to be a little... I kind of want to rock the boat a little bit. I have a hallway, right? Tuition fees are expensive, and education need to be? is priceless. Oh, it needs to be five by five. Oh, I see. I see. I'm make it six by six. Let's go above and beyond. Why not? Okay. So I need. Oh, 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 this is just a door. I forgot to place it. Okay. okay. This little chart thing can be uh, over here beside the door, I think. And this actual machinery can be placed like against the back wall here. I like that. And then this is like opposite that. That's perfect. That's perfect. Science shelf that is unquestionably flammable. I like that. Uh, how do I rotate this? Uh, I'm sure it told me at some point. Not right, Mas, but... Uh, oh, it's already rotated, though, so I like that. Hello, you're, uh, you're... <clears throat> sorry. And a plan. You're listening to Campus Radio. I'm Maggie Watmore, and I didn't realize I was hosting today's show until five Check. minutes ago. There we go. It's okay. I'm sure we'll be fine. I haven't done a show without my notes before, but that doesn't no, matter. Now let's hire a teacher to run our first scientography class. The more you revise, the longer you Hire a teacher. Okay, staff. Magnus Kunk. Interesting name, fella. Scientography, 10% teaching skill, reference bottomless pit. Gets hungry easily. I like that. Used it, didn't lose it. Ooh, now that's a real go-getter right there. Magnus Kunk, you are hired. Scientography could use, the, the entire field of Scientography could use a bright mind like yours. Great work, now we have everything we need to run our Scientography course. All right, when you're ready, select start next year to welcome our first year of students. Okay. Complete a Scientography class. Oh, is this my first student? Students no, that's Magnus Kunk. Students are having on campus. Are you nervous? Why am I nervous? Or oh, are all the students just arriving now? Oh, here we go. <gasps> this is student number one. Oh my god. Wolf or Calf Moon? A little goth, eh? <laughs> Feeling fresh air? Traits Dark Aura. Bestows happiness on others. Okay, outgoing. Oh, we're just going to sit on the bench. Tessamania is who I want. Feeling freshly. What a nice canal. Ooh wee! Another bottomless pit. Interesting. It's hungry easily. Food. Food. Oh, somebody in Scientography? No, that's just that's just Professor Punk. Look at that! The students are in the very first class. Who knows what'll happen? Oh, I see. The class is just getting ready to start. They're all on campus, ready to go. They're just in class now. Interesting. 
So we got Wolf for Calf Moon, Tessa Mania, Randy Fenderson, oops, Willow Weaver, Alf Panther, he's a little nerdy, eh? Now we're bubbling, this means business. Woo! -wee! <laughs> I like the sound of that. The students learn the to gain uh, experience points, or XP, which will increase their academic level. All right. I like the sound of that. Oh, so, so do students like regularly, oh, students regularly come back and I like get to see fucking Wolf or Calf Moon all the time? Oh man, I love that. And, and Alf Panther. Alf Panther and Wolf for Calf Moon right now are, there are my absolute favorites. Although, I think Alf just broke the machine. Oh no, that's uh, Tessa Mania. I also like Tessa Mania. Tessa Mania is pretty sick. That's just a great name. Tessa Mania. It sounds like a, a, an online username, you know? Imagine actually, imagine actually being named Tessa Mania. Holy jeez. Just having the last name Mania in general. Because you can do so many Next things. You can name your shed. kids so many things Apparently. too. That's all I've got. Here to tell us more is Hugh. Oh, who's Hugh? <gasps> Newsroom student radio intro music. Mm -hmm. That's right, the groundskeeper's shed appears to have moved some two to three meters overnight. Oh. But of course, as an inanimate object, the sudden move has come as somewhat of a shock. No, is that a reference to, like, me being a god and moving shit around? The strangest thing to happen in the greater Flemington area. Leading theories range from haunted, haunted wood, wood to tectonic shifting. Tectonic so one fraternity is claiming responsibility for the anomaly. Uh, students mm -hmm. passed the first class. Sadly, they didn't do all that well. That Seems a number, were, were, number of them were distracted by one need or the other. A student that has everything they need will be more happy, less distracted, and be able to focus their studies in an enthusiastic and cheerful haze. Bread and circuses, mate. Bread and circuses. <laughs> keep them happy, keep them, keep them well fed, keep them, keep them entertained. They'll do whatever you tell them to. Students' needs such as their thirst, their toilet comfort, will affect their overall happiness. Happy students perform better in classes and earn more XP. Take a look at our students and see what we can do to improve the campus. Okay, so Piper McGuffin. Key to campus R and R and R. Keep key to campus hospitality is to remember the three R's. Students need somewhere to relax themselves, to rest themselves, and to relieve themselves. Sure, two of those might be the same thing, but it does sound convincing. So why not just do R&R? &R? <laughs> Let's build a dormitory and a bathroom to keep people comfortable. Dormitory and a bathroom. Gotcha. If you don't know where your class is, is it really worth going? Okay, the dorms are gonna be like out in this wing, right? This this whole I think this whole place is gonna be dorms. How how big do the dorms have to be? Two by two? Yeah, I'm actually just gonna probably make it like here. That's like a big dorm, right? Eh? W's. Wait, what? That says that surely says WW rotate, right? Right? Because W is pan up. <laughs> what do you mean WW? <laughs> okay, so it's it's surely just holding left click, right? Yeah. What do you mean double WW? That's so weird. Why would it say that? Why would it why would it lie to me like that? Okay, I need a wardrobe somewhere. The so wardrobe's gonna be like here probably, right? Outside the window. Then we gotta have some beds. Please drink some water. Thank you. The beds are gonna be against this wall, right? As much privacy as well. There's windows outside, eh? So probably like here, where there's no windows, okay? That's easy. Don't want one like right against the wall. I want one like probably here. Here. Here, and then have more shit against that wall, such as this bed here. <laughs> That's fine. Because surely I need more than like that many beds, right? Like I can have. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Should you 
you study with a friend or should you ignore them at all costs? Well, actually, you know what I could do? We all ask Is I could do it like this. Here's Wanda. And have them the like answer. here. Here. Last week, Are these I advised you to try studying in pairs, and it seemed like a good idea. These Turn are time not even. Book, this is a smaller space. Friend. A no-brainer, right? Wrong, I'm afraid. My roommate made up a mnemonic device for something on Here, my I'm course. I'm going to move that there. It was so effective this... that I can't remember what it stands for. All I have He's left even is here, right? decorate my salamanders nightly. And what's that? Sorry, Jesse. Back to here? studying alone. Shame. There we go. That's a bit better, right? That's eight beds. That's probably enough. And then I want some desks, right, to fill in the space. So like here, here, and here. Okay. I like that. I'm really liking this. Um, dorm notice board. Probably gonna place that like right at the front door, right? I want iHeart TP above every bed, obviously, because everybody loves Two Point. <laughs> Just because these were placed here by the school and cannot be removed from the walls uh, without being fined does not mean that the students don't love Two Point. It just means that we know the students love Two Point and are willing to enforce that. That's all. Now I actually kind of want to get this here. You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to place this here. Alright, so we got a bed against the wall. Got this bed here. Okay, we got this. This is going to go here. This is going to go right next to that. Alright, this is better. This is way better. This is how the system should work. Alright. This should go here. Problem is... There's a weird amount of space at the end, eh? But I am just gonna quickly do this. Okay, that's already better. Can I put a thing in there? I can. Oh, that's awesome. And I just want plants galore. Students are reminded that yeah, there's no such thing as free time. Orbitars are a great place for students to relax when they're low on energy. One bed between five students considered normal on campus. Oh! <laughs> I thought I needed a bed for like every student, so I was like, oh man, I need to get like eight beds in here. Okay. Students may dream of having their own bed, but they'll happily share with a few friends. Okay. Um, so in this case, I think eight beds might be a little bit overkill, but hey. At least everybody has their own bed now. Oh, I also need to build a bathroom, I forgot. So I guess it also doesn't need to be that big. The bathroom definitely doesn't need to be that big. I think like that's fine. The door like right next to that. I like that. I like the idea of all the stalls being here. Hi, I'm Jumbo right. McNally. One, two, three, four, just like that. By that and have like by someone that I handpicked. One. That's the Jumbo touch. Two. Jumbo three. Four sinks. Right. Boom. One. Questions. Two. Three. Wasn't on. Hand dryers, just like that. <laughs> we can't we can't have four, but we can have a hand sanitizer right in there like that perfectly. Oh my god, that is amazing. And then another one like right here. Oh yes. And then is there any chance we can get a plant like here? Oh baby. Oh baby, we're rolling in it now. We're rolling in it now. And then another window. Never mind. That's fine. That'll do. Oh, and I got a shower room. But we're gonna wait on that. Did you hear that? I think our students might be hungry. Did 
Kitchen Lake campuses offer a range of food and drink to, you know, sustain life. Let's add some vending machines. I didn't how most universities do it, I'll admit, but fine, we'll add some vending machines, I guess. Cheesy Gubbins machine or a Burt machine? Okay, I guess we'll probably both. And probably both like right outside the door, eh? Oh, it does actually just want us to place both. Yeah, there we go. If it were up to the students, I'm sure we'd all be living in our own filth. Luckily, they have very little say in the matter, as it should be. Let's hire a janitor and place a bin. Keep things nice and tidy. All right, I think I can do that. I can handle it. Uh, Jess, not, oh no, 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 Okay, who, oh, we got a choice this time. Okay, Meryl Scream, Arnold Bottomley, Zoe Gold, or Ned Villain? Boost maintenance speed. Makes themselves smile. Security Happy thoughts. Reach. Aerodynamic. 5% movement Sorry. speed. Ned Villain. Also aerodynamic. Why would I hire Mil Meryl Scream? Meryl Scream sounds awful. I'm just going to hire Ned Villain. With the iron bladder? Doesn't use enough milk? I, I, I love milk, so I'll, I'll drink the whatever he doesn't, you know? Place a bin. I don't want to place a room. I want furniture. And a bin right here. And probably a bin, if possible. Like right here. Somewhere. That's it from us at Campus Radio. I just so want it, like one bin in the wall. I'm heading to the library to finish and start an essay, and I may be oh, there I'm making profit. Night, Let's see how the students do in the next class. Morning for another show. I'm just going to place Hopefully it, like, fall asleep in the right in front of the again. plant there. And Wish the bathroom levels up. Okay. I need Scientography with a C+. Plus. Didn't the student get a C plus before? Who was this class? Laying this kunk. Oh, we see contact. Teaching Scientography It's just a different... Uh, the lecture theater. The lecture theater is used on a wide range of courses, including general knowledge. Upgrade the lectern and tra train your teachers in course-specific qualifications to boost learning rates. The lecture theater can hold student cinema events perfect for boosting student entertainment and happiness. Book an event using the room inspector. Interesting. Hey, how do I book an event? Interesting. Oh my god, this seems like fairly in depth. Scheduled classes? Oh, who's that sleeping? Alf Panther. Alf, you're falling asleep on the job. Come on, pay attention. Professor Kunk is speaking. He's, he's giving you his knowledge. He's, he's bestowing knowledge upon you. And you're just passing out? Come on, my guy. Should have gotten some sleep. I have like eight beds in there. Oh. Here's Ned Villain. Coming to clean up the classroom. Oh, he's making the plant grow. That's actually kind of crazy. I'm kind of suspicious on how we how we managed to do that one. I mean, his name alone makes me kind of suspicious. Maybe he's using some sort of like uh, evil evil concoction to make the plants grow. Like, look at this. He must have gotten that from like poison ivy or something. I don't know. Well done. Those students look smarter already. The better they do, the more money you'll have to fund the campus. Who's smart now? That's ah, that's true. It always comes back to the money. I always, I like you. I like this guy. It always comes back to the money. It always comes back to how we pay the bills. Yes, you uh, receive tuition fees from all students enrolled in courses at the campus, as well as a bonus for how much XP they earn. That's the way it should work. The more they learn, the more they pay. <laughs> Satisfying student needs is just one way to improve our grades. Next on the agenda is a spot of study. Luckily, the students have just been given their first assignments. Ooh. 
Completing assignments is a great way to start st for students to earn XP away from the classroom. Though it looks like they need some new facilities. Check your inbox to see what they need. Okay. How do I open my inbox? Over here. Welcome to your inbox. A place to check on students, requests, disaster warning, and upcoming visits. Some campus issues are time sensitive, so keep an eye out for new messages. Will do, computer, will do. Library required from Randy Fenderson. Library orientation, look at those books. Library, 11,900. Nine people agree. You got a petition signed. Randy, if you get a petition to nine people to get this fucking library belt, I'm gonna build this gosh darn library. That's what I'm gonna do. Build the room. Okay. Okay, uh, well, Randy, you know what? Because you asked for it so nicely. Wait, how, how long? Big three by three? You know what? I'm gonna build it right beside here. There we go. Get your library right by the dorm there. Hey, I'm gonna build you a nice big door. All right, I'm gonna get you. Oh, you like this? Yeah, I like the library reception. Ooh, she's trying to read. Hey, wait, but oh man, wouldn't this be perfect if it could just fit? I love how the record scratched as soon as I canceled the. That was great. That was perfect timing. Just like actually made me stop. I was like, oh shit. Oh, isn't that perfect? They just walk in and she's right there. Hello, how's it going? Actually, I like it much better on the other side. You know why? Because then, then they walk in and she has a little bit of leeway, right? She can look around her little book there and say, hey, I'm over here, you know. It's great. I love that. I love that a lot. Okay. So I need at least one bookshelf. Okay. So I'm going to build a bookshelf. Okay, the back wall is probably going to be... Bookshelf here, and bookshelf Students here. Of right on this reminders. side, I'm gonna build computer cubicles. And reading cubicles. Oh, I see. Oh, it does need uh, access. Okay. That's fine. Maybe I just need one computer cubicle and one reading cubicle. And that'll be fun. Oh, and one study cubicle. There we go. I hope you've taken your medication because it's time for the because Harrison you know why? Wolf show here on Two Point Radio. Oh, that's it's actually even be better. I can just get a book display like this. Yo, yo, and hello. It's Harrison Wolf coming at you with the dulcet sounds of the underground. We've got a good one for you today. But first, yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Some lights I'm gonna get the trash bin Fully probably right radio. here. Actually, coming you know up. what? Plant Next. right here. Trash bin. Students are reminded that some grades right here. Are um, library notice board up against probably this back wall here oh, this is looking so nice look at this it's gorgeous it's absolutely gorgeous i want to get some hand sanitizer probably keep people nice and clean out back here oh man this is beautiful look at this look at this it's gorgeous it's gorgeous okay i need to hire an assistant sammy tool uh, with library management, okay. Or Walter Permacadam. Okay, it's Sammy Tool, because more Ricky than Nigel. I don't get the reference. Doesn't use enough milk. I need a little work. I'm going to get Sammy Tool, because it's probably a bit of a tool, but I kind of like that for a librarian. So I need to complete an assignment in the library? A, a student probably needs to. Some of our students are completing an assignment in the library. An assignment is a great way to earn XP outside of the classroom. Okay, they're all working. There we go. Look at all the students hard at work. They're reading up. There's Randy Fenderson who asked for the library. How you like that, Randy? I dealt with that pretty quick. Pretty darn quick. Let's see how the students do in the next class. 
probably much better because they actually were able to study now with this brand new library. Hey! <laughs> Monthly profit, 9707. Okay. Oh, I see. I gotta dismiss it. Profit, 9707. Man, that is really good. Uh, I've, I've got like half a million dollars, but <laughs> still. What are they doing? Are they play acting? Oh, now they're sick. Their assignment's over, and they're bored. Oh, but he's good friends with Alf Panther. Oh, they have little relationships and stuff. Oh, he's got clubs! Oh, and the, wait, do they each have in, individual, like, personality traits and stuff? Oh my god. Yeah, personality goth, okay, and that, like, I guess defines what they look like, yeah. Oh, jeez. And this is much more in-depth than Two Point Hospital, right? Eh? Like, all these students have, like, actual lives and crap. They have relationships with other students. They've got... Oh, my lord. I wonder how long the students stay on campus on average. Also, it seems like they're, like, getting new students in and out pretty regularly, eh? Or not necessarily out, but in, at the very least. I haven't noticed any students leaving, but it doesn't necessarily mean they have left. Hoping somebody passed with a B. Yeah, they should. They passed with a C plus on the first time, and I didn't really notice what they left with them the next time, but... A lot Let's of see what Henrietta Bell Julie is with. Harrison, what can I do to be more subversive? Well, she's like a relatively can new I student, say, isn't she? First things first, you gotta throw out that question. There's nothing less punk than asking for instructions. You gotta take out the toy, Burn the manual, and use the box to make yourself a groovy fort. That being said, today, this I'll be Professor dishing out Gunn some here. details he's, on he's how to be tired. more subversive you. Oh, 3979. Students have, students have gone from C-grade chumps to B-grade brainheads. Let's recap you. how you did it, shall we? Oh, sorry, that's mine. Educate, provide better staff and facilities to improve your students' grades. Make students happy and comfortable to increase their learning rate, nurture. Expand. Earn more cash by growing your campus and enrolling more students. That's, I understand. That's simple. Congratulations, you've earned some kudosh for completing objectives. Back to kudosh, alright. Spend kudosh to unlock new items as well as staff outfits and interior design options. Okay. Okay, so I have to, oh, to unlock all this. Okay, it looks like there's probably a lot of shit, eh? This is just corridor items. All right, all right, I can dig that. I can dig that. Oh, I need to unlock an. I need to unlock an item with Kudosh. Okay. I mean, I'm immediately just gonna unlock the love trump. Because why wouldn't I unlock the love trump? That sounds spectacular. Obviously, I'm gonna unlock the love trumpet. Is a love trumpet. I've unlocked a student lounge for it apparently, but this love trumpet is going right in the lobby because I need to see what it is. And a staff room. <laughs> Interesting. Randy Fenderson has a new personal goal: relax in the student lounge. That sounds like a very lofty goal, there, Randy. Relax. Oh. It lets people be romance up, apparently. Sure. There's a love trumpet. Uh, so I need to finish my first year on campus. Keep an average staff happiness of 60%, employ five staff members, and build a staff room. Okay, I can do that. Bench press wanted. Alf Panther. And F and Felix Colossus, three level three best friends. Our shared passion is really cool stuff like this. We're just quirky like that. Oh no, Alf Panther, this is the nerdy guy. Our shared passion is really cool stuff like this. Well, he wants to bench press though. What, does he just want to get jacked? Fight the bully? That's great, good on him. I gotta unlock with 75 kudosh? I actually have quite a bit of kudosh. 
I'd much rather get a love bench, though, for Dave Rainbow and Henrietta Belcher. I couldn't figure out why I was suddenly so nervous around my friend. Now I understand. He wants a love bench. Ooh. Roll with me. I can unlock and place Breakfast that. Oh, yeah. Concept. Oh, yeah. You place that. Familiar. If you want to relax with her, you can do that right right out front. To you by the man Invalid in room. Oh, does it need to be in the today. in here? That's why when I wake up, I like a where, where, where's, mold where can the love bench be? And a tall lemonade. I've Take seen like the student lounge or something. Man. Statement. FEB year one. Accept. I'm fine. Student lounge. Okay. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. That's that's what he wants. Not the not the one. Not the student lounge, which is apparently a different room. Okay. It's gonna be three by three. I'm gonna do it here. Probably there. That'll be fine. Okay, I'm gonna build this here, right? And then I'm gonna build. Where is it? Where's my love, love seat, love bench? It's not here, apparently. Yeah, it'd be under furniture. It's not there. Okay, so apparently I can't even build it here. <laughs> Fair enough. So all I need is a couch and a bed. I'll put this here, though. A nice little study table with some pong cups on it, sure. Wrap around chair. I like that. And an armchair. Against the wall there. Nice little fridge. Could I get different colors? Ooh. It's nice. I do want to probably get it blue though, to be honest. Along with, yeah, the, the whole kitchenette set, of course. Microwave counter. All right, kitchen counter. Oh, that's perfect, eh? Burp machine. I probably want a trash can here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dark board up by here. That's nice. Some machines up back here. Oh my god, this is shaping up perfectly. Plagiarism is not a belief system. Got this lamp in here. Oh yeah. I heart TP. Everybody hearts TP, of course. Uh, we all heart two point campus. At Jumbo, we know it's our employees. <laughs> and we want that all our students deal. to know it. That's why they get the Jumbo treatment. Mobile stationery, toilet substitute. Okay, there we go. That's milk, perfect. Leg rooms, That's a great student lounge. And I need to build the staff room. Love bench. Can I place the item in here? Invalid room for love bench. Invalid room for love bench. Invalid room for love bench. I'm Jumbo McNally. And I wish I worked here. Unless it is the library, but that seems weird. Okay. So I need to build a staff room. Students are reminded that this is the fun part. Build that here. Build an equally cool staff room with a little secret entrance there. There we go, get that there. Get that there. Pretty similar design, if we're gonna be honest. Get this nice little coffee table. Grab a little fit, place it too tightly. Ah, I won't even worry about it. Cubby holes, okay, right by the door. Probably even right there, yeah, that's awesome. Get this nice little lamp in the corner here. Perfect. Trash can beside the couch, even better. Ooh, a nice little sofa. Staff are reminded I like the purple in there. Ooh, nice little purple sofa. Uh, I already have a sofa though, so there's not really much of a point, is there? Staff room notice board. Room select. Room select and cellos to buy. <laughs> a 
and go without it is pretty much what you expect in a university. Yeah, that's just great. <laughs> okay, you get a plant out here. Of course. Can't have a room without plants. Never. That'll probably be fine. And I need to employ five staff members. Um... Probably just, it probably just wants me to employ another janitor. Uh, Randy Cosmic. I mean, just the name. Randy Cosmic. Lollygager moves slower than most. Weak bladder. Toilet comfort decreases faster than most. Scrape, scarpers with haste. Interesting. Okay. And then it wants me to probably get another teacher. Is Gil Solomon or June Puffin? Or maybe another assistant. No. Well, I mean, I was going to say another assistant because they might be cheaper, but no. It doesn't seem like it. Uh, Gil Solomon or Jane Puffin? Okay, so weak bladder or iron bladder with dry mouth. <laughs> so a guy who drinks a lot <laughs> and therefore will piss more often, but it's countered by pissing less frequently, or somebody who just pisses more frequently. Probably this guy, eh? Because <laughs> he balances out to nothing, eh? So, get him. Him for the lecture and the other guy for the other class. So I need a level 3 science lab and to complete two assignments. This is the science lab, right? There was a time when the Wolfman spent a lot of time on his So let's see what I can... But that all Bill, changed when I accidentally furniture. put on mismatched shoes the morning after a party, and the compliments started rolling in. I've gotten dressed in the dark ever since. Just you, uh, is there a void, get... and something that could be a sleeve or a trouser right leg. Left. Live dangerously, oh, my here. dudes. Perfect. Science lab. If it's not on your CV, yeah, just get some more science stuff. Not to me. And what does it want me to do here? Whiteboard? Oh, I, I thought this was a TV. So yeah, get some whiteboards, sure. Okay. I mean, seriously? Seriously, you aren't going to be content with that? Trash bin, sure. That's something I actually need. Some more plants, maybe. I mean, like, it feels like. Plant just hidden in the corner. There we go. Finally. And then click to assignments, which I think the students have to do. I need a bench press and a love bench. I'm just gonna buy the bench press. 75 kudosh. Invalid room. Invalid room. Stupid questions. Invalid room. Probably in the shower room, eh? I'll build now. Uh, ooh, I didn't really leave myself much room for shower. Oh, it only needs to be two by one. So what I could theoretically do is just do like this. I'd like that actually. I get like some shower cubicles. One, two, three. And some sinks, even. One, two, three. Towel racks. One, two. Crash. This is a test Side of sinks. Not a real announcement. <laughs> this is a test announcement, not a real announcement. Good to know things. Oh, I could literally just put it underneath. That's great. Apparently. Oh, <laughs> apparently I can place them over top and not the bin underneath. That's fine. I don't need the bin underneath. Can I not place the weight thing here? Jeez, Louise. All right, that'll do that. It's the end of the academic year, in case you haven't noticed. Ooh, let's get some B pluses there. 
like I like to see a B plus. A B plus is pretty nice. Academic results 83%. Woo wee! There we go. That's that's pretty good. I like to do one thing every day that chills me to my core. It puts the key in anarchy, or it's the key to anarchy. There we go, Dave something. Rainbow, giving Anyways, things to study. Important. This morning, I ate some chocolate mousse. Same with Felix Colossus. For days. Colossus. Was These scared? names are awesome. Felix Colossus. The limits. What a name. The they don't want you to eat the warm mousse. One assignment's friends. already done. And isn't that reason enough? And there's two. Average student happiness, 55%. Satisfy two personal goals, develop two best friend friendships. Tuition fees may be spent Fear awards. Congratulations, benefits. you finished the academic year. Let's head to the end of year rewards to celebrate and see how we did. End of year results are now available. Okay, here we go. Right. No unauthorized panicking. Year one. 100% pass rate. Graduating zero. That's fine. It's our first year in operation. We weren't expecting any graduations. Continuing on is 10. 10 people. Sorry, I'm mixing up my directions here. 10 people. Average exam results are 84%. That's not bad. Average? At 84% average? That's pretty high. I mean, we might just be marking them easily, but hey. Hey, well, these are theoretically the, the state-run exams, right? So it's... It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Zero expelled. Zero failed. Zero dropouts. Hey, we're doing fine. Campus of the Year Award goes to Freshly Meadows. Two points. That's me, right? Yay. Average environment attractiveness, 72%. Okay. Average room prestige is four. That's not bad. That's not bad. Rewards 10 kudosh and 5,000 big ones. 5,000 buckarinos. Astrid, graduating zero. We already saw this. And, and the worst. The summer is a good time to relax. The summer break is the perfect time to prepare for the year ahead. Build facilities, make unsustainable design choices, and bask in last year's glory. The academic year is now over. Let's expand our range of courses by starting a virtual normality course. Okay, well actually, before I do that, I'm gonna put a cut in here. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna call it for the night, but this has been fun. Uh, we will be back with playing, playing this game in the future. I, I, I've had a lot of fun here. Uh, but hey, if you're watching this on YouTube, uh, let me know if you enjoyed it. Uh, let me know if there's any sort of uh, ideas that you might have for, for for schools that we could build in the future. I mean, obviously, we're going to kind of be keeping up with the liberal arts college theme, but in any case, uh, we're going to cut her there. Uh, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Have a good one, guys.